Hey there! Ready to dive into some brand new motion design skills? I'm sure you've heard about glitching transitions. It's a unique style commonly used in music videos and commercials. However, here's the catch. Everyone seems to be using the same glitch effects from plugins or other programs. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to craft your very own glitch transition, giving your work a unique touch. Let's begin! To start, download two clips you want to work with. You can check out FreePix videos and select two clips. Of course, you can use your own footage. Just ensure it matches the glitch vibe. Then, look for a glitch effect video too. This is the special part about this tutorial. You can get different results by using different clips. It's all about experimenting. This time, we'll choose this one, which you can find at freepick.com too. Time to fire up After Effects. Import the three clips into the sequence and drop a marker where you want the glitch transition to happen. Make a new composition by dragging the glitch footage. Now, choose a one second segment of the clip. This will be the essence of your glitch transition. Enhance the contrast and brightness using Lumet Recolor And remember, make it black and white, no saturation needed. Now, return to your main composition. Drop the glitch pre-composition into the sequence. Extend one of the clips and split it with Ctrl, Shift, D, or Command, Shift, D on Mac, making it as long as the glitch pre-composition clip, just like this. Time to make some magic. Change the extended clips track mat to Luma mat. This way, the next clip will be revealed through the glitch footage. Hit play and watch. The first clip flickers and seamlessly transitions into the next one. Remember, you can swap the glitch footage for anything you like. Want to spice it up? Time for some chromatic aberration. Let's tidy things up. Right click on all the clips, then choose pre-compose. Now, duplicate it twice with Ctrl D or Command D on Mac. Well done! Search for Set Channels in the Effects and Presets panel. Drag it onto the three clips. Set it to one color channel per layer, just like this. Repeat the process for the other clips. Set the Blending Mode to Add. We're almost there. Now, activate the position toggle and create new keyframes right when the glitch appears. Repeat this process for all the clips. And there you have it, a flawless glitch effect transition, ready to dazzle the world. Try out this transition to enhance your motion graphics portfolio. The possibilities are truly endless. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to explore more amazing video techniques. See you next time.